Uncle Roger at the walk. Does that ring a bell? Uncle Roger always suggests to use a walk to cook Chinese food, but he never explained why it is so important to use the walk to cook Chinese food and how to select a good walk. Today, I'm going to tell you what are the benefits for walk and how to select a good walk. I have a wok and a frying pan here. It is easy to tell that they have a different shape, but this frying pan, you know, this flat bottom is not good to keep the heat inside. It's spreading the heat. But with this bottom, you know, the round bottom of the wok, it is good to concentrate the heat and keep the heat also, the shape, the round shape. And because of the shape, you know, it is also very flexible for this wok to cook different quantity of food. For example, you can fry just one egg on the bottom. It is easy, no problem. But for me, it looks like a joke if I fry one egg in such a big pan. And also, if you want to fry this vegetable, if I use this flat pan to cook this, well, this is my biggest frying pan. Can hold this amount, but however, first of all, it is a non-stick pan. I cannot use this metal spatula. And secondly, even it can hold it, but it cannot be easily to stir. Look, these vegetables will jump around everywhere. However, if you use the wok to do this stir fry, first of all, easily hold this amount. Secondly, with this slow shape, it's so easy and effortless to stir and churn. And another benefit of this wok is, you know, this shape, the round shape, once you cover the lid, look, it's like a ball shape. It concentrates the heat and the steam and also the flavor inside. And cook the vegetables, whatever you want to cook, faster. And with nowadays, you know, the energy bill is so expensive. You, If you use a wok to cook the food, it saves a lot of time and a lot of energy. Think about it. You know, many of the stir-fry dishes, it only takes about a few minutes and many of them even less than a minute. But if you use your oven, you preheat oven for 15 minutes and put in the vegetable there, cook another 20 minutes, more than a half hour. Another very, very good benefit for the wok, it is very multifunctional. Let me show you, right? You know this one can be used for pan fry, for stir fry, and if you add oil inside, it can hold more than two liters oil, oil no problem. And it can for, for deep fry. And also for stew and for soup, boil your noodle or pasta. And also it can use as a steamer. You put the water in and put these small things and put whatever the food you want to steam in the plate and cover it. It's a perfect steamer. And if you want to steam more, look, I have this big steam cage. You put it on top of the wok and cover it. You can use it to steam your Chinese dumpling and Chinese steam bun. If you can only invest, you have a limited budget, can you only invest in one cooking utensil in your kitchen, I suggest to buy a wok. Now that we have talked about the benefits of a wok, and let's talk about how to select a good wok. And I would like to start from uh, what should you avoid first. First, to avoid non-stick material. You know, it doesn't matter how good the coating technology is, this coating eventually will fall off. I mean, maximum life for this non-stick pan is about five years, and you cannot use this metal spatula to stir, to scratch. Second thing you should avoid is too light or too heavy material. For example, a custom arrow. Maybe it is very good for casserole pot, but it is not good to make the wok. You know the Chinese chef likes to do this trick, shake the wok, right? If it's so heavy like custom arrow, we won't be able to, to shake it or easily to stir it. And also, if you use the very light material, it tends to be very thin. If it is very thin and the induction rate is very high, the temperature goes up quickly and your food will be burned easily. So avoid that very thin and very heavy material. And next one, avoid stainless steel. Why? Well, stainless steel is 
easy to care and not getting rust but one drawback of stainless steel is induction rate is very low you know it takes a longer time to increase the temperature or decrease the temperature but it is vital for Chinese stir fry especially stir fry you want the temperature increase and decrease quickly you can you know quick the, quickly cook the food within a short period of time and next one you know Nowadays, with the high technology, people even use the titanium to, to make the wok. However, yeah, titanium, it is very stable, doesn't release any bad chemical, but the problem is also the induction rate is low and the price is so high. After we talk about what you should avoid, and let's talk about what you should buy. And I recommend you buy a high carbon steel wok. For example, this one, this wok I have, I bought it uh, about eight years ago in China, cost less than 50 pounds, and it's a uh, carbon steel, very resilient. You use, I use my metal spatula, you know, you scratch, stir, you never worry about, you know, you damage it. By the way, if you want to date a Chinese lady, look at this video. And the benefit of this carbon steel wok is also, it is uh, the induction rate is not very high, not very low. The weight is not that light and not very heavy. And you can easily do this uh, uh, trick, you know, shake and stir. And only drawback of this carbon steel wok is it does get rust. If you buy a carbon steel wok, before you use it, you season it. It's very important. The best way is use a piece of pork fat. You know, you heat up the wok with a low heat and use this piece of fat rub it then this oil you know the pork oil release and cold on this wok and then leave this oil on for two or three days don't touch it and then you can wash it and use it cook food and every time after you use the, this wok you wash it and dry it immediately to prevent it getting rust and in the end I suggest if you can find, well, if you can find a hand forged carbon steel wok, I suggest to buy it because it will last you your lifetime, guarantee. By the way, if you check my YouTube channel, Easy E A Z Z Y Chinese, you will find many recipes which I use the wok to cook the delicious Chinese food. And also, you can visit my website. I uploaded an article very detail you know in terms of uh, what are the benefits of a walk and how to select a good walk remember to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell thank you